Hello everyone, this is Sachin Savant, your UK immigration lawyer. Today I am going to talk about uh, graduate route visa, your BRP is due to expire, your student visa BRP is due to expire, you want to apply for the graduate route. However, your degree is technically not complete. So it may be at whatever stage you submitted all your assessments, you passed it, but still the, the university has not confirmed that the degree is complete. You do know that it is going to be complete. Yes, you are sure about it. So what to do? Yes, we do get many inquiries about this uh, where individuals are stuck. Their student visa is going to end and uh, yeah, the university has still not sent the notification. So when you complete the degree, the university would ideally send a notification. Usually they send it to you also uh, in an email and to home office also they have a way to send the intimation that this particular individual applicant has completed the degree. So without that confirmation, home office will not approve your graduate route visa. Very important. So what to do? This is something that the explanation I'm giving here should be done very carefully. Preferably always do it through a legal representative. We have done several applications. We do write a exhaustive covering letter explaining everything. And we ask the case working team to also contact the uni in case they don't get the intimation as per the immigration rules the important thing is the date of decision so the way this can be done okay so we would not advise individual clients to do it but this is what we would do in in your circumstances if you're stuck and if you represent if you ask us to represent you we have done it many times successfully so it's not there is no risk in this but this, this is this is a part of the immigration rules so there is nothing um, I'm not trying to make up anything over here. So uh, as per the rules, on the date of decision, your degree should be complete. Okay. So not on the date of application. So this is very, very important. So you, let's say your student visa is expiring today. Today is 2nd of June, 2023. We would submit your application and ask the case working team. Sometimes it may or we may also ask them to hold it. Sometimes we may ask them to contact the uni or depending on whatever the circumstances is. But the important thing is at least if you are sure that there, there are ways to also delay the date of decision. It's not that much of a thing. I would not advise this for, to, for anyone to do it. But I know there are many students who have contacted and towards the end of their leaves, they just they are in the last week or they have three days remaining that's why i just wanted to make this video to help out those students that yes it is possible preferably contact any other legal representative we can do it we have done it several times uh, and we can file the application even if the confirmation is not given by the university yet and after that before the date of decision or latest on the date of decision we may all we will also if required ask the caseworker to contact the university and there is a way there is a mechanism how they can contact them and get a confirmation so at least on the date of decision your uni your degree should be complete if your degree is not complete even on the date of decision your application will be refused i'll repeat that if on the date of decision even after we asking and the caseworker trying to contact your university if they confirm if they don't confirm that your degree is con degree is complete, your application will be refused. That's the main reason I'm saying all of this should be done very carefully. Always do it through a legal representative, through a lawyer. Uh, I myself, we are registered with the, with the OISC, Office of the Immigration Services Commissioner at level three. We do appeals, advocacy, everything. So yes, and in this case, definitely there has to be some legal representations, some submissions. Uh, to be made uh, to the case working team and so this is the main thing that I wanted to cover there is a situation where your BRP is expiring your student visa BRP still the degree confirmation is pending from the uni side then this is what how we would go about and but definitely for your particular situation do contact us we every one situation is different we will advise specifically on individual matters so don't just take it this as a blanket advice but this is generally what we would do so we just wanted to show what we have usually done in the past and this is what we would do it is possible i know many times students will ask oh what to do now should i leave the uk etc 
no if you know that you have passed all your assessments and you know that you, your degree will be given eventually so then it is worth filing this application and taking it from there also in future if at all this application can also be varied if there are other reasons you get a skilled worker leave or something if before the date of decision anything can be done either an intimation can be sent that is just another option you can file we also file for variation sometimes halfway through clients tell us that oh i don't want the graduate route i want a skilled worker visa now i have a certificate of sponsorship so yes before a decision is made definitely the application can be varied uh, this is all in the immigration rules so we can file another application for the skilled worker visa sometimes people say they found partners they want to apply for unmarried partner visa or they want to go in the any human rights category spouse visa parent visa etc so if that is the case that is happening then it can be varied before the decision also but the main thing that i wanted to cover in this video is your degree is pending brp is expiring what to do yes an application can be filed a degree confirmation has to be received by the case worker case working team latest by the date of decision if the degree confirmation is not being given by the university by the date of decision then your application for graduate route visa will be refused that is very very important for your specific case definitely seek the advice of a qualified immigration advisor we do advise on such matters uh, if you want to discuss your matters please do book a consultation with us and if you like this video do give us a thumbs up click on the notifications icon to get notifications and subscribe to our channel this is very very important if you subscribe if you do like this video there are i know there are many many students coming through from all over the world and they are stuck with this question yes because we ourselves have got several phone calls emails etc on these matters that was the main reason i wanted to cover this so you at least have some idea as to what is possible and you decide what you want to do from there so do like this video if you like this youtube will throw this to others who are in need there are many students in need uh, they may or may not be able to afford the fees of immigration lawyers just to get this answer to make a decision this is quite a life decision for them so yes do like this video do follow our channel subscribe to our channel and this way youtube will throw it to others who are in need if they search for a graduate route visa or something this video will come up uh, yeah it will save someone maybe a, a lifetime a career or maybe their life that depends on this so it's, it's very very important uh, so do like this video subscribe to our channel also we publish videos on tiktok you can also follow us on tiktok yeah follow us on various social platforms facebook tiktok etc etc and thank you very much for watching